I can do this on my own I tried so many times but I end up alone When I was in seventh grade, my parents told me that they were getting a divorce. This news just turned my whole world upside down. Seventh grade was the beginning of the downward slide for me, uh, and I started drinking in eighth grade. When I was young, I gave my life to Christ. And when life started falling apart, instead of reaching out to him and crying out to God, I took my life back. And I got a phone call from my friends in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. They asked me to come down for a weekend for a golf tournament. Well, I got down there and we went to the bar. And I drank and drank. I got into a huge fight with my friends. I spent two and a half days in a holding cell, about a 10 by 12 room. And I had a lot of time to just pray for forgiveness, pray for direction in my life. Proverbs 3, verses 5 and 6, tells us, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and do not rely on your own insight. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He will make straight your paths. And it's hard to see the other side when you're going through it, but if we allow God to work in us through our struggles, He can use everything we go through to benefit His kingdom. We just have to be willing to to fight through it and stay faithful. And although I failed you in every storm I sailed through, you were there with me. You are here with me. I can't trust my feet or my eyes to see. So tonight I I knew that I needed to make real changes in my life, and I knew that the first thing I needed to do was turn back to the way I was raised, back to God, and back to faith. Father, today I turn to you. I've run out of dead end roads to choose. Lord, I need you to take my hand. God makes a way where there seems to be no way. And it just, it just never ceases to amaze me the way that He can work if we let Him work. We'll be given new eyes to see. We'll shed the chains and become free. Whosoever believes in me, Lord, you should me that. Whosoever believes in me will be given new eyes to see. We'll shed their chains and be.